Today we're going to learn about the five senses. What are the five senses? Do you know? It's touch, hearing, sight, smell, and taste. What can you smell? Do you smell dead stuff sometimes? Do you smell a bad odor? Food smells good. Spaghetti is really good. So smell is sometimes a good thing and sometimes it's a bad thing, you know. What can you feel? You can feel each other. You can feel texture. You can feel plants. You can feel animals. Sometimes they're soft. Sometimes they're hairy. Sometimes they're, they feel weird overall. Um, what can you hear? You can hear noises. If you hear ringing in your ears, that means you're listening to your music too loud. You need to turn it down a bit because when you get older, you're going to regret that because you ain't able to hear at all and it's permanent. Telephones, you can hear the telephones ringing. You actually kind of can hear a vibration. If your phone's on vibration, you can hear it. Taste, you can taste apples. Apples are really healthy for you. You should really include that into your daily meals. Spaghetti, I love spaghetti. Do you all like spaghetti? Yeah, I bet y'all do. Hamburgers, chicken, pizza, anything that you can taste can be good, can be sour, can be bitter, can be awful. It's whatever you like. See, sight. What can you see? You can see each other. Some people are colorblind. They cannot see colors. Uh, you can see texture. You can see back there, there's texture on those uh, bricks. You can see pretty much anything. If you can see, you can see, right? Um, what can you feel? I think I just did that one. You can feel coldness, you can feel the warmness, you can feel each other, you can feel something biting you or something like itching you're like ah, going crazy. Yeah, feel is an interesting sense. Some of us wish we didn't feel. Taste. Anything that can be put in the mouth and taste sweet, sour, bitter, and hot. Hot is like chili peppers or hot like something just now came out of the oven. It's like hot, 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 hot. Yeah. It can really burn your mouth and do not ever drink cold after you ate something hot because it will probably hurt your teeth. Bitter. Bitter is usually like Brussels sprouts. People say it's bitter. I think they taste good, but I bet you, look, you guys think it tastes nasty too, huh? Sour, sour is like Sour Pouch Kids. I hate those. They hurt my mouth. I think it spoils it, actually. Yeah, I see you little kids liking those. Sweet, sweet can be like candy bars, Hershey's, cupcakes, pop. Pop's real sweet. It makes you really hyper, too. Sight. To see with the eyes. Anything you can see, that's sight. You can see each other. You can see this room. You can see textures, color things moving outside, you can see anything. Some people are actually colorblind. That means they only see black and white. They can feel like a deer. They can't see color at all. So sight is very important. Keep your eyes healthy. Smell. Anything that can be smelled through the nose. The nose is this part of your area of your face. It has two holes, so you know that's the nose. Can't be anything else. So, smells can be smell really, really good, like flowers, spaghetti, food. Anything, perfumes, they smell good, colognes, yes. It can also be like a bad smell, like a dead something, like a runover skunk. You smell that like a mile away, you're like, yeah, that's a skunk, mom. Definitely a skunk. Hearing, any noise that can be heard in the ears. This is the part of your ears. Yeah, y'all are little, mine are big. But when you grow up, your ears are really sensitive even when you're young. So when you're young, make sure you take care of them. Do not put music in your ears and turn up the volume because someday when you grow up, you're going to regret that because you can't hear at all. And it's permanent damage. You can use hearing aids, but sooner or later, it's just not going to work anymore. So be careful with your ears. Touch. Anything that be felt by skin. That's each other. You can feel the hotness when you do this, you can feel your own skin, you can feel textures, you can feel objects, it can be anything, really. You can feel like something biting you, you can feel like itchiness and you're just like going crazy, or you're cold and you're like, oh, burr, turn the air conditioner down. You can feel hotness, which I'm actually hot right now, my skin's red, so. You can feel anything in the skin. 
And it can be like your toes, your fingers. It doesn't just have to be body skin. It can be anything. Your face. Okay, now we're going to do our activity. Okay, so yeah, it's right here. The five senses. What are the five senses? We just talked about them. You all know? Sight, nose, taste, and sound, and feeling. Okay, and smell. Okay, match the words to the picture. This is your tongue. What's your tongue used for? Exactly. It's used for taste. You can taste sour, bitter, sweet, hot. Some tastes don't even have taste, so just I guess uneven. So this one would be taste. Taste is key and it's important. We love taste. So we're going to put a heart on taste because we love taste. Okay, what's this? It has two holes. It's by your face. Yes, that's right. It's smell. Anything you can smell. Some people can't smell, which I guess is a good thing. Depends what the smell is, but smell is whatever you think smells good. Okay, I'm going to put smell on this. Smell. What is this? Your hand. What is your hand used for? What are you doing right now? You're touching. Yes. Touch. What's that? That's your ear. It has holes in it. Actually, it just has one hole. And it goes to the other ear. That's hearing. You can hear anything. You can hear me talking. It's not amazing. What is this? Your eyes. What do your eyes do? They see. They see everything or anything. Some people are colorblind, you know, so they do not see colors. They still can see textures, but they can't see colors. So that is sight. So we're going to erase this and go to our next activity. Can y'all guess a sense? Sight? Maybe. Let's touch that. See what does it say? Well, I just want to do it. That one says sight. Where's your eyes? These are your eyes, right? Everybody has different color eyes. But... Mm. Well, that's one's not going to work. What's another sense? Smell? Your nose? You smell good stuff, bad stuff? Sometimes you just wish you didn't have a nose because you don't want to smell that. Okay, what's another thing? Do you hear me talking? Yes, that's sound. So that's hearing. Whatever I hear. What's another thing? Taste? Food's a key thing. Without food, you probably won't be here today. Taste is really good. Everybody loves taste. I'm going to put a number 10 on it because taste is Oops. Yeah. Okay, go. what's the last one? Touch. Well, touch, you I you like to probably be dull. You have to have touch to feel things, to experience things. Okay. Whoops. Now we're going to erase this. Take these off. So we can move that on. Just every little guy. senses. Can y'all listen anything? What do you do with your touch? Or what, what do you use your senses for? What can you touch? Tables? Each other? Yeah. What can you hear? 
you can conversations, you can hear animal noises, you can hear the projector thingy, you can hear the wind in it. See, what can you see? You can see each other, you can see the color, you see texture. Yep. Taste. Taste is a key thing. And <coughs> I hope everybody has taste because it's delicious, it's bitter, and it's sour, and I wish I never tasted that before. Smell. Anything you smell could be either good or bad. Depends what you like. What do you see taste like? What do, what do you think that, what is that? What do y'all think that is? A pepper? A green pepper? Do you like green peppers? They have a, a different taste, but they're really good for you, and they taste really good. How about this? What do you think that tastes like? Lemons? That's a lemon? Yeah. It's sour. It's really sour, and it kind of makes you, that weird face you'll get like, ugh, you know? And what's that? I'm guessing that's french fries. So, french fries have salt on them, so they would be salty. What is that? That's a cupcake. Cupcakes are delicious. We love them. Of course we do. So, it's sweet. I guess the pepper would be called bitter. bitter. depends on who's eating it. Okay. Do these things have a smell? Do you think pigs have a smell? Or do these things have a smell? Yeah. Can you smell pigs? Yeah. Can you? No? Let's put our eggs on this then. I bet skunk. Look at the little yellow stuff come out of him. Yeah, skunk smell bad. You're not get, ever get around one. You're going to wish you never did. How about sun? Can you smell the sun? Of course you can't smell the sun. Can't even touch the sun. How about flowers? Can you smell flowers? Smell good? Most flowers? Roses? Yeah. You can smell them. See, check answers. Oh, we got one wrong. You can't smell a pig. Spigs do have a smell. What things make these sounds? Listen really carefully, class. Be flat, quiet. picture to the right word. What do you think a teddy bear feels like? Feels really soft, smooth, soft. Oops. Well, I'm supposed to use this. How about an alligator? Have you ever felt an alligator before? A crocodile? Ever worn the boots? Yeah, they feel kind of rough. Let's put that over here. How about soap? When you put it underneath water and it's like, it just goes everywhere. Yep, that's slippery. How about a mirror? How does a mirror feel? Not the glass part, the back of it. Smooth. And a softball, I'm guessing, or a baseball. It looks like a baseball. It feels real soft because of the hide. Or hard, I mean. No, soft. Let's see if those are right, y'all. Well, I think it's right. Can't be wrong. <laughs> okay, let's erase this. Describe what you see. What do you see over there? I see a boat. Do y'all see the little, little boat? Uh, probably some glasses or binoculars to see that. I see trees. What else do y'all see? Concrete, dirt. Whatever that is saying, yeah. Your eyes are very important, so always take care of your eyes. Watch your eyes. You just gotta learn how to live another way, guys.
Okay, that's the end of our lesson. I hope y'all enjoyed it and actually learned something. We'll have another fun activity tomorrow. Have a good day.